The isProtected error usually happens when you define your own function and then try to do something with it, like plotting. Here I have a string of letters for my variable name, and I want this to be the x cubed plus log x function. Now I'm going to plot it along the domain from negative 10 to 10. But when I run the cell, nothing comes up. Looking back at my code, I realized that I forgot the x underscore and the square brackets on the left side of the equal sign. When I make that correction, I run this cell and get this error. Tag plus in x cubed plus log x is protected. Why is this happening? The code is correct. This is how we define a function. Let me demonstrate this error again, all in the same cell. I have a new function here. I notice that I'm still forgetting the x underscore and square brackets. And even if it's in the same cell, I correct the code and I get this is protected error. So how does this happen? Let's analyze two parts of the error message. The parentheses and the x underscore and square brackets correspond to the variable we are trying to use. Inside of these parentheses is what Mathematica currently has stored underneath the variable name. In this case, it is the x cubed plus log x expression from the first line of code that we evaluated. When this code is evaluated, everything on the right side of the equals sign is assigned to the name on the left side. Thus, the error message is telling us that we cannot use function name because it is currently recognized as being x cubed plus log x. Of course, a variable name should be an unused string of letters and symbols, and we are not allowed to redefine anything built into Mathematica, such as the log command. To see this another way, we might as well have typed this line of code. Note that we get the exact same error. So how do we fix it? We will be using the clear command. We don't want function name to be recognized as x cubed plus log x any longer, and using the clear command will erase all memory stored to the strings and symbols placed within the square brackets of clear. Note, if you want to clear multiple variable names in the same line of code, just separate them by commas. In this case, it might be a good idea to clear x as well, in case I've stored x to be some value somewhere else in my notebook. Also note, clear is a built-in Mathematica command, so only the c should be capitalized and square brackets are needed. Here's a tip. While you can run the clear command anywhere in the notebook before you run the corrected function definition, it's always safe to clear each variable at the top of any cell, where those variables are used on the left side of an equals sign. With clear at the top, no matter where I place the cell in any notebook, the clear command ensures that no other definitions can interfere with my code, and I only have to run this cell once to get my plot. As a last point, the command commonly discovered by students, called clear all, does not clear all variables by itself, as in some commands do in MATLAB or other languages. Actually, clear all functions quite similarly to the clear command in that, of course it needs a capital C and a capital A, but it also needs square brackets and you still need to specify which variable names you want cleared, and to separate them by commas. So in this case, this is the wrong way to try and fix our isProtected error. Notice that the clear all line does nothing by itself. The correct way is to specify that we want to clear the sum function variable name. I can also clear x if I wanted to, just like we do with the clear command. See the documentation center if you want to know more about the differences between clear and clear all. And that is all. As always, visit the math lab in Fisher 331 for further help if you need it. Talk to us on Google Hangouts during lab hours or email your course coordinator.